Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Annalisa and this is Homemade Sunshine. So, I'm filming this part one. Um, it'll all be together in the video, but part one of my Hobby Lobby 90% off Christmas clearance haul. Um, my mom got a lot more stuff at her store than I did, so I'm going to share. I'll film sometime this weekend once I get the things that she picked up for me and I give her the things I picked up for her. I'll film what she found for me at her store. So, um, the Hobby Lobby clearance was, I think, the Monday after New Year's this year. I could be wrong, but um, my store had a decent selection, but two things for Hobby Lobby is, one, you have to be so careful that things aren't broken. I mean, the quality for Hobby Lobby stuff is, is not, like, amazing, um, but at 90% off, you know, that's, that's a pretty good deal. So, the quality not being the best doesn't bother me as much. So you have to first be careful that things aren't broken. And two, if your store is like super busy, that doesn't necessarily mean that you're not gonna be able to get anything. So my store had like nobody. There was like me and a few other people shopping, but not a ton of people. My mom's store had a ton of people, but she had way more selection of stuff on clearance than we did. So kind of, you know, it balances out, but also, one complaint for Hobby Lobby, um, they need to make their carts bigger. I don't know why their carts are so small. I don't know if anybody else feels the same as me, but I feel like their shopping carts are tiny, considering how large so many of their items are that they sell. So, just a tiny little, little gripe of mine. But, let me show you first what I got. So, I spent nine-ish dollars, I think, with tax for all of my items. And, yeah, so, I'm very excited. First, I picked up this set. It was, um, what is that? Like, uh, it was $22.99, so 90% um, off of that. So very, very cheap are these sweet little bells, which I hope you can see that. My lighting is kind of weird today. So it says, joy to the world. Jesus is the reason for the season and peace. And they're just little bells. I don't know if you can, they've got them packaged in here well, and I don't want to take them out because, well, they're going to go in my attic after this. Um, just super pretty. I loved the gold lettering. I thought that was very pretty. Um, this would have been about 49 cents for this next item from the Robert Stanley line. Um, just a mesh runner. And the mesh, if you can see, actually the lighting will help with this, is snowflakes. So I have a pretty blue runner that I picked up that's solid from either Easter or spring 90% off at one point. So I thought this would look really pretty layered over that for winter. So I'm gonna try that out and see if that looks cute but very, very pretty. Um, next, this is just something, you know, ch chintzy for, you know, <laughs> just dirt cheap because it was only $1.99 to start with. So, you know, like 19 cents are some ornament hooks, but we needed some. So this was a good time to pick them up. I also picked this up. This is Fireside Night Scented Candle. It was $5.99 originally, so 59 cents. And oh my gosh, look how pretty. It's just, it, I like the wrap, but I mean, the wrap will come off when I put it in there. It only had a slight defect of like this being a little chip, but it's wax. It'll be fine. So I'll just, if you can see in the background, once one of these Bath and Body Works candles gets finished, I'll clean the wax out of it, put this inside of it, and then burn it like that. Also, look how cute this new Bath and Body Works. Let me turn this on. You can only kind of see it in here. Maybe you can. Yeah, see how it like sparkles and swirls? It's so cute. I'll leave that on. I got that for Christmas this year. It's very pretty. And then here's something random that I didn't know that they put on sale, but some command hook adjustable little hooks. Do I need these? No, but these are so expensive when you do need them. Um, it's originally $14.99, but it was $1.50. So the reason that I knew that these were included with the sales, if you can see here, it says Christmas lights and accessories. So basically, as long as it says something like the Christmas shop on it, or the tag says Christmas 2022, it'll be a part of the Christmas sale. Now these were also Robert Stanley. These were 69 cents. These are going to my mom because my cat would eat these. Um, they are glitter poinsettia table scatters. And they're just really pretty. They've just got a little green thing on the back like for to keep them weighted down. So that'll just look really cute out on a tablescape. And then my last two little items, which I've got to get kind of, they like to get tangled with one another. Um, one is going to my mom and I'm going to keep one, is these ornaments, how much were they? 59 cents each, since they were $5.99. So this is the red one. 
Oh, it looks so pretty in the light right now. Oh my gosh. I was worried the lighting would be bad for this, but actually it pick, picks up the glittery stuff really well. And then this one, which I've got to like adjust around so it gets there, in there correctly. It's this one, which is white. So beautiful either way. And I've got pretty little ribbons on the top. So two gorgeous little ornaments, just like that. So those are, that is my itty bitty teeny tiny little haul for you guys from Hobby Lobby. Like I said, I didn't find much, but um, I will share with you guys what my mom picked up for me at her store, which was a lot more stuff. I don't know why her Hobby Lobby has way more things than mine does. I don't know if mine necessarily gets shopped more, if it's just a smaller store, but I don't know. Very happy with my little haul though, but I think what I'm most excited about out of this is the little, um, is the little snowflake runner. I can't wait to set that out because I love just the look of that. So. That's it for this part, and I'll see you in the next part. Hey y'all, so here is part two of the Hobby Lobby haul, like I promised. Um, my mom got a lot more stuff at her store, and a lot of it was very large stuff. So, I've got all of that to show you, and I've also got a few things to show you that I picked up today at my Walmart on the 90% cr Christmas clearance deals. So, but we'll start with Hobby Lobby first. So, she picked us up some Christmas tins to be able to put gifts in next year or to take um you know christmas cookies to a holiday event all of that sort of thing so first is this very pretty tin it was 4.99 so 49 cents and then the same one but a slightly smaller version for 4.59 so um so about you know similarly priced to that first one and then next is this really cute Merry Christmas tin it was originally $4.99 so 49 cents basically 50 cents with tax but those are my little Christmas tins I'm excited to use those for next year this is a big item this was originally $33.99 it is a very big beautiful Merry Christmas welcome Matt Oh, it's very large, so it's hard to hold it up. Super duper cute. And, you know, basically $3.39. So, not expensive at all. Here's my next little bag of goodie. Oh, I'm also now covered in... <laughs> I've got to put, the, put all of this up later, but I'm now covered in little things from the welcome mat. This is just a cute little plate to put on the display. It's the most wonderful time of the year. And it was $2.99 originally, so 29 cents. Just something cute to add to a display. Then this cute buffalo plaid runner for how much? $12.99. So $1.29 there. Very good deal. And two Buffalo Chad. Buffalo check plaid placemats, which are originally $3.99 each, so $0.39. Cents. Very fun, very festive, but you can leave them out all winter too. And then she picked us up some gift tags because we were both like out, out of gift tags. So these were, this one was $0.29. Cents. This just says Merry Christmas and says to and from on the back. These are some Santas, also $0.29. Cents. These are cute little, have yourself a merry little Christmas. These are gorgeous. I love that one. Also 29 cents. And then these say Merry Christmas in a funky little pattern. She also picked us up these. These would be 69 cents. Just a little battery pack of some little colorful Christmas bulbs. I love putting out like the twinkly lights. And then she picked us up um, each a dashing through the snow beautiful little um, tea towel, which was originally $10.99. So very, very good deal there. And then this pretty faux box, it's not got a back to it, just to put up for decoration, originally $19.99. So about $2 on sale. Two bags down, and a couple more to go. This was very, very pretty. This pretty rustic Merry Christmas long box. It's so originally, wherever the price is, well, actually, I don't see the price. So, I won't be able to tell you that one, because I don't have any idea. But, I'm sure it was not very expensive. And now this bag, 
is all of the Christmassy picks for like the tree, which there's some of these. These are $2.99, so these are 29 cents each. Just a bunch of these pretty sparkly picks. I won't pull everything out because they're all very carefully in here. There's a bunch of these silver poinsettias, which were $3.99 originally, so 39 cents each. And then there's also the same poinsettia in red. So very cute, fun picks for the tree or to use on a wreath or in um, a vase. So we'll see what I end up using those for next year. Then I'm gonna pull over a couple more things over to here. First, we call these the Christmas sandbags. So this is a cute little one that says Merry Christmas. It's just very lightweight. It was originally $32.99, so very good deal on that. I'll be putting this by my fireplace next Christmas. And then last, but certainly not least, is two Christmas yard picks. So this one is a snowman that says Let It Snow. Originally $37.99, which is crazy. But I'm excited to put these out in front of our house. I, we have a we have a really good front yard to have yard picks in. So let me put that down. And his other friend, his other friend for going in the yard is Santa Claus. Which he has a little sign that says Merry Christmas. There's his little feet. And he is super cute. So that is all of the Hobby Lobby stuff, which I think he was similarly priced. Yep, $37.99. So about $3.80 for that. So very cute, and I'll show you what I got at Walmart, which I have my receipt here. And um, I've got my receipt, and I will tell you how much each of these items were. So I picked up two packs of gift tags, one for me, one for my mom. Very cheap, like 22 cents. I think they rang up 22 cents when I picked them up. Let me see. Um, yep, yeah, 22 cents, so dirt cheap. I picked us up both. I'll only show one because these match, um, which these will be going to her for her birthday. Her birthday's in the fall, which means I usually give her like Christmas themed stuff at her fall birthday. So she'll get these for her birthday, but she's already seen them. So I double checked before I brought them in the store. So there's this cute set that says warm and toasty with these beautiful red plaid pants. So, so cute. These were $1.30 for the set, the whole thing, which is um, a killer, killer deal. And I love that. That's from the Joy Spun line at Walmart, which I really like that line. So just imagine that times two, cause I have one also. And then I picked up this Joy Spun set, also $1.30, which is this pretty fun stripes with pretty fun striped pants. So, and they have pockets, which is even better which I like that these are both like not very Christmassy sets. They're just kind of holiday themed, but they're not, you could wear them throughout the Christmas or the cold winter months. What I'm trying to say is cold winter months. <laughs> and then hilariously, these cost more than those sets. These were a buck 49, but um, I would have picked her up a pair, but they did not have her size. But these are these beautiful Hachi fabric. I think you're saying, I'm saying that right, H-A-C-C-I. Um, pajama pants with that beautiful pattern with the deer and the trees and I think that's pretty because it still also looks wintry and not so much Christmassy so I scanned to check all the prices in my um, Walmart app because some things that you would really be thinking were on sale were not like there was a set of these pajamas that had Christmas trees on them and they were not 90% off so Oh, it just goes to so sometimes you don't know that's why I like to really check at the register that everything's ringing up correctly so and now I've gotten a good deal so that is my big all of the after Christmas sales are over thank goodness and that is my big haul um let me know did you get anything on you know 90% off or less I don't shop discounts less than 90% off because I don't feel like I need anything this is all just extra stuff so I don't shop at 75 or even 50 but you know it's different for everybody you might actually need stuff and you know year to year you might need to be getting things you know um, like this year there was like no bags on clearance um, whereas a couple years ago I got a ton of bags on 90% off and so I've been pretty set on those but that is
is my haul. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. I always like to do my 90% off holiday sales hauls. I don't know if I'll be finding anything at Valentine's Day. You never know. We'll see you when that rolls around next month. So, um, I will catch you guys later. Bye.